Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play City Skylines. We have a poop problem! No! The poop problem is real. Uh, we're going to have to get some sewage treatment. Yes, another, another sewage treatment plant right over here. Oh, so good. This is really uh, flooding everything soon. It's, it's great. It's fantastic. It's what we always wanted. Uh, we're trying to get to 55,000 people. That is the current goal. And we're trying to keep our city happy. I, I heard we had some crime problems over here. Crime. 5%. Hmm. I guess we can always put a small police station at this area. Well, it's not the worst idea. It makes people around there happy as well. Uh, here we actually have quite a few. Uh, we have the small police booths here. And I feel... As I said earlier, I wanted to put um, some services on the hill here. How about like a nice big fire station? Maybe a small one will just do fine. Let's see. It, it might actually do fine. Might be enough. Let's turn it on. Uh, schools. Oh, yes. Right. The circle is uh, reserved for all. Oh, space already occupied. By roads? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Oh, that's what it looks like. That's your argument there. Okay. How about uh, the other education places? Crap, the slope is too steep. There you go. University. Are we going to need a university? I kind of feel we have enough universities, let's face it. I mean, there's one right down there. I swear, how is that not enough? How is that? No, there's... We have a capacity of 14,000 people. How? How? Because you can't reach them. Because there's no road connecting you. Is that, is that the problem? It probably is. Fine. Here. I'll, I'll build some crossroads right in between. Oh yeah, they're all upgrading. So this is university down here. Uh, first of all, we should connect those roads with each other. Cool. Then we should go up one step and... Hmm. I could do something with this here. I mean, it already looks fairly silly. Space already occupied. Is it the power lines here? Because I'll, I'll gladly get rid of those. I don't think we need them. Just taking up space, obviously. I mean, I'm always willing to try some more unorthodox solutions, so to speak. But it's not, it's not getting really easy here, is it now? Okay, so let's... How, how's too steep, too steep, too steep? Ah, it's just... Okay, may, maybe I should not build these crazy things right now. And just, just see how it goes, because... Yeah, there's a few buildings that don't get... All the education, but come on. How, how, how are you? Oh, wow, yeah, high schools. We don't even have nearly enough. I just realized that, how bad the situation actually is. Um, having a high school here sounds like a great idea until you realize that most residentials now live up here. So. Yeah, you're unhappy. Nobody cares. Look at that. Look at that. It's really hard for them to, to get here. So many eligible. That might be the biggest the biggest issue so far. We just don't have enough enough high schools for everyone. I wish I could upgrade those SimCity style, like add more things to one particular high school. I'd really like that. Okay, I can probably also increase capacity, I just realized, because this is only at 90%. Now let's bring this up to 100%. 101. Yeah, capacity is slowly approaching... <laughs> is slowly approaching it. Wow. This is re really a uh, uh, very much a required thing here. Four schools, four high schools. And they're not considered universities. Okay, how about trash? Because we have so many people now coming in. Incineration status. Yeah, this is looking tricky. I'm gonna uh, build another small incineration plant. Right over here. Whoop. Just to help out a little bit. Just a little bit. It's a little too steep. Is this thing even on? Not operating. Why? Why are you not operating? What's what's the what's the hap hap? You should be operating. I didn't on, off. What why? Mm, if I put you on the other side. Maybe it takes a while to kick in. That that's entirely possible. Nothing happens within a day. So Oh, we got criminals over there? Yeah. Crime is not looking... Crime is looking like a problem here. So, let's go ahead and connect this area to the rest of the world. And make some nice round roads. Yes. 
Gosh, that's my jam. Okay, I, I kind of want um, a connection before that. This. Way better. And we're going to connect it down here, giving the uh, crematorium and the cemetery easy access to this area, hopefully. Yep, that, that'll work. That'll do. And we have some we have some uh, business that wants to move in, understandably so. It is uh it is pretty it's growing quite a bit. 47,000. We're gonna be able to be uh at 55,000 and buy all the lots fairly soon if this keeps going. Very good. Okay, they said they want business. They can have some business. How about we put the business here? This is all gonna be business, high density even. Can you believe it? All the high density business just for you. It's not even tourism. Um, I'm kind of intrigued. I kind of want to build offices here as a separating measure. Oh. Let's, uh, make this. Let's remove this and make this offices too. To see how this goes. Uh, I figure we could upgrade those roads to be on the safe side. While nothing too much is... Ah, I can't upgrade this, obviously. What about, though, if we... Connect this. Yeah, we're, we're gonna build a nice, uh, a huge road connection here. Nice intersection. Might as well clog it a little bit more. Interesting. And we're gonna hook it up to this. And having an earlier exit here would be really nice. Wow! I didn't realize that I didn't zone out anything here at all. Shocking. Well, it gives me a good opportunity to. Hook up more roads, like this. <laughs> you know what? Maybe we can we can make it a little bit more useful. Actually, enable buildings to be placed um, on the ground. Slope too steep. How, how is this still too steep? Possibly. Okay, good enough. I'll take it. I hope that allows people to drive around a little bit. Oh no, water! Right, water zoning a problem as usual. Just to be on the safe side, I will actually zone it around here as well. Good. Good. Good, 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 good. Uh, 48,000. How, how are things looking over here? Oh yeah, right. Park value, land value is probably not very high. I would love to have some nice parks here. It seems that the roads are... We, we, need, we need some straight roads as well. I, I, I hate saying that, but we do. We really do. Um, maybe not through here. How, how would that work out for you? Wow, you know, except, <laughs> God, it's okay, it's okay. I'll, I'll fill up the rest with beautiful, 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 beautiful uh, trees. How about that? Here, big, nice park. And a smaller park over here. Don't worry, be happy. I said be happy, please. Um. A little small park if they want one, but I, hmm, squeezing even that here makes makes it hard. Sunken in plaza. I guess this is just how it goes. I'll 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 have to remove some buildings to make these guys happy. I'm so sorry. And here we're gonna build a sunken plaza. I really like this mod, the sunken plaza. Makes business very very excited to be here. Looking good, looking good. What are they saying? Not enough educated workers. Are you kidding me? We have so many high schools here. I'm really surprised that we're not being better at this. How about I increase the budget? Budget by, let's say, 120%. More for the schools. Make schools happy again. Same with parks. We could increase it by 10%. Make them a little bit more effective. Mm, raising health care. I wonder, like, increasing this during the night. It's really different at night. What if we increase this at night? Or decreased it at night, increased it during the day. 80% and 20% more during the day. I'm, I'm gonna try this, just to have more of a focus at it during the day. Same with schools. This is gonna be, yeah, let's keep it at 120 all time, just to be safe. Use this to 90, parks and plazas. I want it constantly to be, have a positive effect though. Oh, water is at 90%. We should probably put this to 100 again. And I'm good. 
So how are you guys doing? Trash! Trash collection seems to be an issue. It's a new hot topic of 2016. Help, nobody's picking up my trash. I mean, I'll gladly build more incineration plants, even though they cost how much? 1,400 per week. I hope it helps. I hope it helps. If we look at our graphs, this, these are usually really helpful. Crematorium availability, we're, we're so good. Cemetery usage, we could start burning the people. We should do that. Landfill usage, zero. Incineration status is good. Healthcare availability, we're good. We're good. Fire hazard is down to 18%. Unemployment. I did not know our unemployment was like 33%. Hmm. We have a, have a high demand for people to move in. But not a lot of people actually working here. What is it with offices? Taxation. Tax raise for offices. Tax re Can I get some tax relief for offices? There you go. In the hopes that they will move in. We might not have enough skilled workers, won't we? Garbage has piled up. What if we move one of the incinerators? I know they make a lot of, like, like trash and such. No, that's not a good idea. Maybe a sem- uh, uh, hmm. I mean, they have to drive quite a bit to actually make it in here. Yeah, can we go underground? Yeah. It should be possible, though, for them. Oh, right. Oh, my. Ah, uh, how did I not see that? I'm pretty sure you saw that and you're super upset at me right now. There's no way to reach the inner circle like that. There's no way. Why would I even... I'm so silly. I'm so silly. Now, now I think, now I think we, we dealt with this properly. <laughs> no wonder this isn't happening. Same with, same with education. Nobody was able to actually go up here. And the garbage should be, should be good. Now capacity 10,000, that's good. Yeah, it's look, look, looking fine. Highly educated, 42%, 44%. That's good. How is industry doing? It's telling me that it has no access to the road. What is? What doesn't have access? Something's weird right now here. Did we lose access to a road somewhere along the lines? <laughs> it tells me there's no access to the road, but is it the bus stop? What, what are you doing? You, you're going home. You're standing around. You're not going anywhere. I guess it is the bus stop. That must be. That must be it. Oh yeah. There is no route anymore. I am so incredibly sorry. Can can we... I did a weird thing with it, and it's hopefully connected back up again. Ah, there we go. I moved the bus stop to the other side, which was a horrible idea. Um, I, I, I hope this fixes the bus route. Industry is not looking hot, hot at all, if you look at this. It is really not looking hot at all, operating normally. Three overeducated workers. Oh, okay. Plenty of overeducated workers, plenty of jobs available. Okay, everyone's overeducated. That's fantastic. That's that's good news. 16 overeducated workers. Cool. Everyone's overeducated. What what if we use offices? For educated citizens, make sure you have a university in the city. Oh, I have a university in the city. Ah, no risk, no fun, am I right? We're going to remove all of this. Can you imagine it? All of this, the whole industry, the whole industry loop is going to become the business loop. Or I should call it the office loop for, for, for obvious reasons. Yeah, I know. You don't have electricity anymore. Nobody cares. Tax relief for offices? And brr, what else would make them happy? I don't even know. Hmm. No idea. What we should do is put down the offices and, and, and hope that somebody moves in. I really hope that. Here. All of this offices. The office loop. What an interesting zone. Uh, probably so have some um, business. Some, what do you call it? Oh, right. Is that recycling? Oh, recycling centers. They're not, they're not going to like that. They're not going to like having recycling centers right next to them. They are not going to like this one bit. So where to put them? I guess we can always put some over on this side. We'll keep them in here for now. We'll, we'll see how much they complain. We'll see how much they complain. Japanese garden is always good. Small playground. Yeah, you don't have enough electricity for a playground. What kind of playground is that? If you need electricity. 
Usually not a good idea. Anyways, specialization, no specialization, no specialization. Didn't, didn't I set that? Okay, no, no, none. Good. What I did want to set is some areas for commercial to have, uh, you know, to offer this to offices. They need like their sub shops and whatever else people that go there do. McDonald's. Just, you know, the place where you can go eat with your uh, co-workers. Yeah, it looks good. This is super not gonna work, is it? This is super not gonna work. How do I get offices in here? I have... I have taxes here, offices. What if we reduce that to 1%? Oh, that's a, that's a Cadillac. That's, that's not what I was looking for. That's a park. A parking lot. Oh, offices are coming in. Ah, <gasps> multimedia center, hooray! I mean, giving them 1% usually, you know, attracts everyone. That's a huge boost. We're basically paying them if we're reducing this by 2%. Okay. So, everything is super polluted because this is where industry was before. So it's probably a good idea to tackle that. I doubt that we're going to be able to put trees down like in some city and get rid of that. We will just have to wait it out. Now, employment percentage, how is it looking? 64%, we need more jobs, not more people. This is, this is a big issue. Uh, we have a lot of overeducated people on this side. I wonder if I can set Blair Witch to schools out. Prefer working over education. Good. That's that we have. Hmm. Okay. I was I was hoping this would do enough to supply them with uneducated people, but I guess I'm wrong. I guess I'm completely wrong. These offices have been doing fairly well. I mean, now they're doing really well considering that they're not paying any taxes whatsoever. Whatsoever. Wow, this is looking really nice here in the sunset. I, I, li I like this new area. Tourism Trap is probably doing really well, from what I can tell. Commercial zones, office zones. So how do we get your level up? How do we get the... Oh wait, that's a multimedia center. That's not an office. I forgot. These are not offices. We're not having a single office in here. <gasps> this is bad. Oh no, we have we have 48,000 people living here, but people are slowly moving out and I do not I do not like it. I assume these people aren't going to move in because uh, noise. The noise levels are too high, really. How high are they? They are insanely loud. It's the recycling center. Yes. Okay, we're going to have to move this. We're going to have to face this relocating cost 9,000. That's that's fairly cheap. That's not a problem. Let's move them over here in the middle of nowhere. If that is a problem, I can understand that they would be upset at that. I hope it helps out a bit. Brings the noise value down quite a bit. Yeah, and they're slowly moving in again. I'm uh, sorry, that's the wrong one. Noises over here. I mean, obviously they are creating noise. They are friggin... Yeah, of course they're gonna create noise. Uh, which reminds me, we should be upgrading those roads. Considering that we're gonna have offices here, we need nice roads. The nice, with the nice, the nice ones with trees. I wonder if we can just build the huge circle around here, like two lane roads. It will probably tell me that things are too steep again. So, uh, whatever. The trees should help a little bit with the noise as well. One of the advantages of placing them is to reduce noise. Yeah, that's, that's working fine. We're still making plenty of money thanks to not paying for smoke detectors. Uh, what's going on? Fire safety over here. Ugh. Guys, you are... You, this is a train wreck. A fire safety train wreck. Here. And we want... We have so many people moving in. We're going to be able to reach those 55,000 in no time once I zone out more places. Um, we could make this a high-density area. We could make these high-density housing. I could make this. And maybe remove the zoning of these houses to put schools and such here. I hope this is good enough. And yeah. That's what we're gonna do. Skyscrapers on the hillside. Okay, so right now there's a medium demand for zoning and they're, they're slowly moving in here. 
What I'm considering doing is reducing taxes for the zone to 9%, anything basically to 9%, and yeah, industrial 9% too. Keep it all at the same level, and this, this is probably gonna cost us a huge chunk of our income. I'm gonna increase offices to 4%, and yeah, we can already see the weekly income drop like crazy, but I hope it helps uh, uh, encourage people to live here. Um, from what I can tell, it doesn't. At least not yet. It just cost us a lot of money. Jeez, Luis. I I'm taking it back. I'm taking it back. I'm, I'm, I'm I hope 10% is feasible because I don't want to go any lower than that. It's already starting to hurt pretty bad. Okay, this is balancing itself out minus 4000. Um what are we out of like oh, electricity available is pretty low. Because during the night it goes down? No, it doesn't. It actually doesn't. It, it, it does not. I guess we just have more people coming in and that costing more money. All right, can we squeeze some solar anywhere else? We're, we're already using a lot of space up here for solar. And I had to build all these curvy roads, didn't I? I, I of course had to. How about we build it across the airport or on the field over here? I mean, it's already super loud at the airport, so who, who cares? Here you go. Must be a nice sight to fly over that and see them. See the, see the, uh, solar arrays. I hope that's enough. Let's see. Ah, yes. Plenty of uh, electricity available again. Of course. People, that people need to get picked up again. Maybe we should just keep it at 100% during all times. And it looks like we're kind of breaking even here. So it's going up and down a little bit. If we add a little bit more zoning, it will be just fine. But people are still moving out. And I'm not entirely sure why. They're getting so well educated. I mean, these are not. These people are not. Maybe we should consider not educating everyone. <sighs> Plenty of capacity. University. 20,000 available. Are you, are you for real? There's 20,000 available spots. And only a few thousand use it. Well, that, that that's fantastic. I'm pretty sure that's not a waste of money. No, well, it might, might be worth considering turning them on or off. I turned off this university in the hopes that that will help a bit. Yeah, we have so many. Four universities. I will turn this one off as well. And there's still plenty, plenty available. Plenty available. So, maybe people are going to be not overeducated. Oh. Great. The farmer's on fire. How much you want to bet that that's insurance fraud? <laughs> oh, God. Shouldn't you be sleeping, you silly cows? Oh, my ears. That's... This is something that needs to be addressed. The cow mewing. Meowing. What? Mooing. Cut. <laughs> yep, the cows are meowing. You can, you can quote me on that. Please, please do. I want. Uh, that's what I want to be known for. Anyways, looks like the whole city is dying again because there's dead people that need to be picked up. This is this is what always bugs me in this game is is the insane amount of dead people. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm Weasel. I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye bye. And off we go on a magic adventure or something. The train is not in great condition. Well, so let's fix it. This is an experimental model. Oh, you're the assistant engineer. Uh, oh yeah, the blockers. What about them? You remember the accident at Exler S?